All right, it's mm. time to flush your DNS. Uh, first you're going to do is view your DNS to see all the entries. Then you're going to flush it, and then do it again to make sure everything was erased. First, whether you're an XP, server, or Vista, it all works the same. You can go to Start Run, or if you're in Vista, you can just type in CMD. In Vista, you'll want to definitely run as admin, so that you don't run it into any administrative action conflicts. Uh, Vista is different than XP and server. Normally, you would just hit Start Run type in CMD and a command line pops up, whereas when you're in Vista, you're going to have to give it added permissions if you have UAC enabled. When you start up a command prompt, you're going to have it say, C Windows System 32. It does not matter where it's at, just type in IP config space forward slash display DNS and hit enter. You can scroll up and see all of the entries within your DNS files. Uh, if you haven't flushed your DNS recently, it should be pretty extensive. Now type in IP config space forward slash flush DNS. We're going to flush the toilet on the DNS. Flush successful on the DNS resolve. Now we're going to type in IP config display DNS again. Now we have an en empty response unlike previous, and it'll stay empty until we surf once again. Thank you, and I hope this was helpful.